like don't play like i'm not the one like this is my hair this is my hair what do you mean hey bitches welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new it's your girl ashton alliance it's your girl who bitches ashton alliance you guys oh my guys and my girls i'm back your girl's back Pinky girl is back, okay? I'm so excited to film this video today. I know it's been so long. Like, it's been a cool little minute. I've been off of social media, off of YouTube, ducked off by my dolo. Girl, it's been a lot going on, okay? So, I've been low-key going through it. Okay, because I'm back and I'm better, you know? I needed that time alone to myself. I needed that break, you know, to just let things go realize who the fuck i am realize my worth realize what i'm doing here like what i'm here to do on this earth like i just been going through a whole lot okay the whole night like i feel like i i had an ego death and i've been rebirthed so you know i'm back and i'm better i want you back is that vibe oh i just cracked my neck bro i be doing too much but no seriously i'm back and i'm i feel so good like this feels so good to sit here and record like <sighs> Today, girl, I know you've seen that title. I know you've seen it. Do y'all see this bum ass hair? Look at it. What? Period. Silky hair. Look at that. Look at how long my hair is, y'all. Like, it goes past my ass. Like, girl, don't play with me. Don't play with me, okay? Do not play with that girl. I'm not one of them. I sit on my hair when I sit down. If you don't sit on your hair, when you sit down, there ain't shit to talk about. You can't compete when you don't compete. Okay. So before we get into, you know, installing it, teaching you guys how to get your um wig to look like scalp, like it's growing out of your hair. Like somebody say that's a wig. No, this is my hair. Look up close. This is my hair. Like you want it to be like that. And I'm gonna show y'all how to get it right like that, okay? Like the other girlies don't be telling y'all how to get it like that, but I'm gonna get it like that for y'all, okay? I'm gonna tell y'all how to get it like that. This hair is from West Kiss Hair. This is the packaging that it came in. To so open it, I mean, I, oh my gosh. And I've already like, clearly I've opened it. Um, I've already opened the box, you know, looked through it and whatever. So um, everything comes in this bag well, first off girl they sent me a bonnet okay and it's a two-tone bonnet like <laughs> if you've been watching me you know i'm pinky girl like if you can't tell already everything gotta be pink brush gotta be pink razor gotta be pink clips gotta be pink more clips like girl my lace blue is pink don't play with me i really wish that um this bonnet was pink or whatever but i'm just really excited at the fact that it's a big bonnet got you a little scarf or a little tiara on it a crown like girl and it's velvet like they give you a wig cap face some lashes i think i said this in almost like a, all of my wig videos because like the hair be really fine but if it's some fucked up hair i'm gonna let you know but when i tell you this is the best best straight hair i've ever had west kiss straight hair hd lace Girl, I ain't never had no HD lace. But we gonna see what it's talking about today, okay? We gonna see what it's talking about. Shout out to West Kids. Y'all really put a bitch on, okay? Like. Girl, that's some bomb ass hair. That's all I'm gonna say. Now, the only thing that I didn't really like was how hard it was. Like, how stubborn the knots were. It was so much plucking that I had to do. Like. It was so much. Hair was the hairline was so thick. That's the only thing. It didn't come pre-plucked, and it hurt. The knots were so harsh. But yeah, that's the only downside of this wig. I'm gonna stop wrapping y'all up. I just had to let y'all, you know, get in on this hair. It's really bomb. Shout out to West Kiss once again for sponsoring this video. Thank you guys so much for sending on giving me this bomb wig. Like I love this hair so much. I genuinely, truly love this hair. Now we're gonna get right into the video on how to. Get your lace to look like a motherfucking scalp. Don't mind my peanut ass head. I got my fucking hair again. We're not gonna talk about that. We're gonna talk about this wig and how to get it to look like your scalp. Like it's growing from your head. Okay, so first things first, girl, you gotta bleach your knots, okay? You have to bleach your knots. When Once you bleach the knots, if you look up closely, you see that there's no more like black dots on the wig. Bleaching your knots is essential. It's key to getting a bomb install. You have to bleach your knots. 
that's number one but number two baby the day i found this out the day i really invested in myself and bought this product my life changed so this product is Sally hansen airbrush legs water resistant and this is basically tanning spray tanning spray on your lace top tier Lace blending one on one with Ashton Alon, aka Pinky Girl. Get some tanning spray, spread that motherfucker on your lace. Scalp. Here's what my lace is looking like without the spray. This is just from Bleaching the Knot, period. This is what it's looking like. It's already giving scalp, as you can see. It's very well giving scalp. Be careful because this can get a little messy. It can get a little messy, okay? So, and make sure you spray from afar you don't want to spray it too close because it'll literally go through the lace and make your hair brown and now the lace is looking like super tinted and we love that we love it so yeah those are the two simple easy steps to take so that your lace can look like it's growing out of your fucking scalp the glue that i'm gonna be using today is um hd glue this is what it looks like. It's very fast drying. It says it's waterproof. I've never tried, you know, to go under the water with it. Maximum hold, non-toxic. And their Instagram and Twitter is HD glue. Now let me tell you, bitch, this is some bomb glue. Once I heard HD glue, I just felt it in my soul. Like, okay, it gotta be top notch. It gotta be top of the top, top tier. I don't know what's in this glue, but it is the best the best fucking glue i've ever used i've used esha i've used erica j i use ghost bonds i've never used bold Ho. a lot of people are fans of boho i've never used it but once i got my hands on it like hd glue bomb period i would never go back ever and one more thing that i didn't let y'all know about this wig i thought this would be like a frontal you know but it's kind of like okay so so this little gap that's lace right there it doesn't go all the way back it's just this little gap this much parting space in the middle of my head that's the only thing i didn't like about this wig because it's like it's very minimal like you can only really like do a middle part you can't do that much you know besides that the wig is bomb top tier a1 actually do my laces a little different now i actually like this way better a whole lot better i do two three layers but i do it all over the perimeter of my ball cap and i love it period i'm not gonna talk through this part because it's kind of self-explanatory but i will be back to show you guys the finished product and i'll leave the camera rolling so that you can see what i'm doing I'm over here trying to think, should I just leave it at three or should I put four? Because, why not? Like, I think I want this to be on my head for a little minute. So, four it is. So this is the best part like this is the part like the finale hold on I got glue in my fucking hair this is the one girl she's ready you know she's ready when she's clear I done put four coats on I ain't never did that shit before I'm a little anxious but you know it's time to shine
I didn't press it in yet because I'm not sure. Like, I just want to make sure, you know, that everything is aligned and it's where it should be. So now you can just press it in. Um, I don't know what the fuck I was about to do. I think it's too far back. Fuck me. Oh my gosh. Is it too far back? <sighs> That's the best and the worst part. Because it's like so many things could go so wrong. But so many things could also go so right. And in this situation, I feel like it just went right. I don't know what it is, but I could plug so bomb on my left side, right? And then you get to the right and it's like, well, baby, what went wrong? Like you had one job it's always like that like i hate that shit like i literally hate that shit bro right now i'm about to cut my lace completely off i went in and glued down the pieces that needed to be glued down right now i'm about to cut this bitch off Once I do the baby hairs, it's really about to be looking like my hair. Like, what are you talking about? That is how you cut a lace, girl. I'm about to lay it down with my little scarf that they sent me but before i'm gonna take some free spray and just spray like you know the perimeter the scarf is so cute however i do wish that it was pink but you know this will do it's still cute to me so i'm gonna leave this on my hair for probably about like 20 minutes 15 20 minutes i'm gonna go you know get some grub you know get some food and all of that there so don't go anywhere just wait for me i'll be right back okay but like do we see these baby hairs my hair is all done period i did my baby hairs off of camera because it was just a lot like i didn't feel like doing them on camera i needed to really focus and you know do what i needed to do okay period if y'all were wondering what i used for my baby hairs um i just used this little edge comb or brush whatever and the one and only nairobi i love me some nairobi it's a little bit on the you know like the pricier side but it's really good so like yeah i love it take a little bit of my free spray it's a little quick tip so like if you don't want any flyaways or whatever just brush it on the top of your hair and just like that you're done hold on almost forgot we gotta put on our little lip gloss because we a bad bitch now. And boom. Just like that, you done. Period. Don't play with me. This hair is. Period. You done. That is how you get your wig to look like a motherfucking scalp. Okay? This is how you get your wig to look like it's growing out of your hair this is my hair i grew it from my scalp it took me like 10 years like don't play hello sorry i can't hear you over my 30 inch bundles now, this is the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed i hope you learned something and i hope my you know scalp technique will help you or help someone and once again shout out to west kiss hair for sponsoring this video and sending me this bomb ass wig like this is about to be my new favorite wig this is about to be my summer wig like girl i hope you guys enjoy once again and i'll see you guys in my next video bye bitches